Hi friends, welcome to the channel, the Dynamic Resource Forum. During my first video, rather an introductory video, I had explained you that I shall be launching the various videos, especially for the students of standard 10th and 9th, those who shall be facing their CBSE examination in the year 2019-20. Well, Today I propose to launch the initial video. This is going to be the part one of the history chapter, the nationalism in India. Now this chapter is a very important chapter from your history subject. The questions are obviously to be asked during the examination. So let us proceed further with the chapter, the nationalism in India. Now when you open your textbooks, you come across various things. And the first and foremost thing that you come across is about the First World War. There is a reference of the First World War in the chapter, The Nationalism in India. Now, dear students, you need to understand in what way the First World War, it had an impact in India for fostering or for developing the feeling of nationalism among Indians. Now let us go back to the history, let us turn back or let us turn the pages of the history and try to understand when the first world war it was broken out. What were the consequences? We are not going to go into the details of the first world war but in nutshell you must be aware about the history of the first world war. So when we talk about the first world war, let us see when the first world war is started. The first world war is started on July 28, 1914 and ended on November 11, 1918. Dear students, the war always had the devastating effects. No country can afford the war, but even then the history witnessed the world war one and the World War II. Albert Einstein, you know, he was asked a question, if at all third world war breaks, what will happen? Immediately he replied, if at all the third world war breaks out, no one will be surviving, no one will be there to see the effects of the war. So when we talk about the first world war, let us understand what were the causes of the first world war. You know, when I try to explain you the causes of the First World War or the reasons for the First World War, let us try to analyze it with the word mania, M-A-N-I-A. -A. Mania means in the Europe, there was a competition that the militarism, that means European countries, they had adopted the policy of building up a strong military power for war. They started preparing their country for the wars and in addition to that the variance alliances were formed. Alliances here means the agreement between the nations to provide aid and protect one another. So they formed the various alliances, the triple alliance and triple entity. These were the two alliances that were formed. So entire Europe it, it was divided into the alliances. There was a competition of forming the alliances with each other. The next that was important for the cause of the First World War was imperialism. Now several times you would be coming across when you study the chapter in detail, the terminology imperialism. Now what do you mean by imperialism? Imperialism, it is a policy. When one country takes over another country economically and politically. Here we need to understand the British people, the United Kingdom, the Great Britain, they had adopted the policy of imperialism and they started spreading their empire throughout the world and India too was the victim of imperialism. And the instant cause for the first world war was the assassination. Now, here the assassination you need to understand, assassination means the political murder. Whenever we refer the word assassination, 
it is entirely different from that of murder. We say Mahatma Gandhi was assassinated, Indra Gandhi was assassinated. So the instant cause for the First World War was the assassination of Austrian Archduke Francis Ferdinand. And this was the instant cause for breaking up or for starting the First World War in the world. Now when this First World War broke out, naturally our country it was ruled by the British people. Since the Britishers they had adopted the policy of imperialism and this first world war helped in developing the feeling of nationalism among the people of India. We, I shall be discussing in what way the first world war had an effect for the development of feeling of nationalism in India during the first world war. So don't forget to see the next video on the topic the nationalism as a part two. Thank you. Please subscribe the video and share it.